Hey everybody, Ace Channel Liam here. Welcome back to the latest episode of the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. You may be asking, Liam, why the hell are you wearing a face mask? You're not going out anywhere. You don't need to be anywhere right now. You're not going out into a public place. You're not going into a building that's littered with people who have been exposed to other people who may have been exposed to a deadly virus. Why are you wearing a mask? I'm wearing a mask to prove a freaking point. I'm wearing a mask to prove that it's not a problem wearing a mask. It doesn't hinder my speech that much. It doesn't hinder my fucking breathing. I won't be able to understand. It's really easy to wear a mask. And that's why I'm going to wear a mask for this entire episode. And you're going to just enjoy it and like it. And you don't have to look at my horrible face for a change. Isn't that nice? You get masked face and the full on shiny forehead look. It's a beautiful compromise. How great is that? So I'm just doing this just to prove points. It's easy to wear a mask. Answer me the question of the day, which comes from Bexicano, who's very, very lovely, who says, if you could fuse two Pokemon. So like, basically the question was a lot longer. It was like, if you can DNA evolve Pokemon a la DNA Digivolution Digimon. So take two Pokemon, evolve them, combine them into a super duper ultimate Pokemon. What two Pokemon would you combine? I would combine uh, I would combine, oh, I would combine, I would combine Horlucha and Lucario. I think, someone draw me that, a Lucario Horlucha fusion. I think that'd be pretty cool. Let me know what you think down in the comments below and suggest a question today for everybody to answer over on Twitter with the hashtag ATLQOTD. Now we're in this gym. I don't really remember this gym, I'll be honest, so I'm not sure where I'm going. But, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna try. And we're gonna try and figure it out. We, we press the buttons, yes? Oh no, there's a double battle. Battles hinge on the strength of your spirit. The weak-minded will never win. Weak-spirited will never win. The roads you have traveled. What have you experienced? Come at me with everything you've learned. My word. I can't wait for this battle. I'm excited. Are you excited? Can you see the excitement? No, you can't see the excitement in my face. That's not the point. It's easy to wear a mask. Grow the fuck up. Here we go. We got a Golbat and we got a Skip Loom. We got ATL2 and Tongs out. So I think we're going to be okay. Oh, we trace Chlorophyll. So if Sunny Day comes into effect. ATL2 is going to be well fast. We're going to go for a Psybeam on the Golbat. We're going to go for a Poison Fang on the Skip Loom. And that's going to lead to a good day, hopefully. Okay, Wing Attack on ATL2. I am against two Flying types. So I need to be careful with old Tongs out there. Oh, we don't have to worry about the other flying type right now because Tongs has been taken down. Sorry, Skiploom has been taken down by Tongs. Here we go. And now it's over to ATL2 with that beautiful Psybeam. Look at that. Oh, I didn't really do a lot. But you know what? It was there. It happened. I am going to go for a Psybeam again, but I am going to switch Tongs out just to get someone else a little bit more experience. Uh, let's bring out Banassi. Banassi could do with leveling up just that little bit. So, Banassi's out. All good. No biggie there. Golbat's going to bite, and that's going to be beautiful. It's going to be fine. It was a crit, though. Got to be careful. Here's a Psybeam, though. No flinches for us. No flinches. Just a Psybeam. We're going to go Psybeam again. We're going to go Shadow Ball, just to be on the safe side. There we go. Critical hit. Oh, that's worrying, actually. I keep... Why do I keep wanting to be on the enemy team? I keep kind of going, yeah, the enemy did something. That's really cool. I need to pay more attention. Oh, people are going to yell at me. Yell at me in the comments. Liam, you're not taking good care of your Pokemon. Liam, your Pokemon are dying and that creates a little bit of drama in the video and makes it a little bit more exciting, a little bit scary. But, you know, try not to let your Pokemon die. And you're just like, dude, I've, I've been nuzlocke for years. I, I, know, I know the threats. I know the problems. I know the worries. But I'm not worried. Oh, spin me right round. Okay, lovely. Hello. Oh, no. Oh, watch me levitate a Pokeball tenacolitically. Oh, tenacolit... Tenac... Can we just really quick? Tenacol... Tenacinetically. In a... Game made for seven-year-olds. The word tenekinetically in a game for seven-year-olds. Sometimes I'm out of sync. <laughs> I see it. I see your future. If you could beat me, I would tell you a future. My only, my only difficulty when I wear a mask, by the way, is that I have a beard, and my beard and my chin create friction on the mask and drag it down. But you know, it just means I have to be aware. That's all. Right, Dudley with the gold pin. Okay, we can do this. Tongs is going to win the game for everyone. Uh, Tongs is going to go for Psybeam on the Gulpin. No, ATL2 is going to go for Psybeam on the Gulpin. Tongs is going to go for Poison Fang and hope that we don't get killed by a Magby. 
We could probably knock out the Mag B. That's pretty strong. Yeah, critical here. That scope lens coming into play. Thank you very much right there, my good friend Tongs. Partridge is level 28. That's beautiful. Wants to learn Mist? No, thank you. Stop learning Mist. Yes, please. Here's the Psy Beam. It won't kill because it's ATL2, but it'll do a decent chunk of damage, I reckon. Yeah, not too bad. Gulping went for Toxic, and of course it's on ATL2 because it wouldn't go for the... Uh, wouldn't go for the poison type. No biggie there. ATL2 is indeed hurt by the poison, and that's a sad time. Uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna keep fighting. Why did I use poison fang on a poison type? Because I'm just that hardcore. Don't you worry. There's the psi beam. There's the death of the gulpin. We're good. We're good. Everyone's happy. Good. 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 Right. Go to my bag. I don't need a hyper potion, but I do need an antidote. That much is very true. So let's carry on up when you're down. Oh, I've got to make a choice. I'm going for the left. And... Okay. But it does mean this room is kind of blocked off. Let me see your talent. Oh, oh, oh. you need me to show you how tenacious the psychic type can be. Oh, I absolutely do. I couldn't think of anything I'd rather do more than find out the joys of psychic types. Nido Queen and Snorlax. Okay. Okay. All jokes aside, that's pretty bad. We're going to go Psybeam on the Nido Queen. We are going to get Tongs the hell out of dodge right now. We're going to bring in... Aqua Ace. And I'm finally going to remember. You guys have been telling me for weeks and I'm finally going to remember that uh, Surf doesn't hit allies in Generation 3. Because that's something I've been forgetting for a very long time. But that's okay. So I'm going to go for a Surf with our Aqua Ace. And it's going to be fine. Snorlax went yawn because Snorlax is a prick. You prick, Snorlax. It's fine. We're going to side beam the Nido Queen. We're going to Surf on the opponents. That's a knockout on the Nido Queen. Critical hit as well. Fa thank you very much, Aqua Ace. That was beautiful. And Snorlax takes a tiny lick of damage, of course. Everyone's happy, though. We've got a Psy Beam. Let's go. Let's go Psy Beam. Come on. That's nothing. It's not actually use Rest. Okay, we need to bring out the big guns. Okay, all that's left, though, is Snorlax. So we got a couple of turns. Okay, ATL2 is asleep. But we're going to switch ATL2 out. Bring in Partridge, because we know Snorlax is going to be asleep for a little bit. We're going to go for a Submission. A bit risky. A bit risky, because it's got recoil damage. I'd rather a different fighting type move. Aqua Ace is going Submission. It's a lovely hit, but it's going to come with a lot of re... Oh, no, not a lot of recoil damage, actually. Snorlax is fast asleep. That's all good. We're going to go for Fury Attack, and we're going to go for Submission. Submission will probably do it. Submission will probably take the Snorlax out, and there it is. Good news. Thank you, Aqua Ace. And that means Partridge will get some nice experience. Look at that, ATL2. Oh, okay. 742 for Partridge. That was good. That was some good experience. My battle style is fantastic, according to the main main. So I'm going to head into my bag, and I'm going to go... Oh, I went the wrong way. I went the wrong way, and I need to go to... Hyper Potion, please. And I also need an Awakening, please. Awakening on ATL2. Lovely. Lovely stuff. I mean, the button did move everyone back, but I think I have to go this way. Yeah, this is fine. Let me show you a perfectly awful, horrifying time. Oh, that's not very nice. Oh, I've uh, tasted my super Pokemon hard battling power. Is that what you're going to tell me? Is that the kind of attitude I need from you right now? What I need, Webster and Malcolm, is just a good old Pokemon battle. Combuskin and Pineco. I'm feeling quietly confident that's going to explode. That Pineco is going to explode. That's what's about to happen. So we're going to Psybeam the Combuscan and we're going to bring out someone who can take a few better hits like Banassi. That's the plan. So Banassi comes in. Banassi not worried. There's the Psybeam on the Combuscan. I do have to worry about Combuscan using like... Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't, I was going to say, like, using, like, Jump Kick or something on ATL2, you know, with the super effective fighting type moves with Stab, but no, we're okay. Pineco's going Bide, so I'm going to Sharpen. 
And I'm just going to switch Pokemon to Partridge. Okay, so sharpen. Up goes ATL2's attack. Pinko store an energy. Sharpen again. Switch Pokemon again to Modo. There it is. Unleash the energy. And it failed. Unfortunate for the you. Well, let's go for Secret Power. And let's go for Flamethrower. Good job, Modo. You got this, my boy. Easy peasy. Look at that. That's beautiful. 45 experience for everybody. Except Partridge. Good stuff. Gotta love divided experience. Those were the days, right? Pokemon used to level up so slowly. It was so tedious. Oh, so. Your boy can make choice now. And that was the wrong choice. Okay. Alright, fam. Alright, fam. We got this. Alright. I'm not fighting you all again. There you go. Wait. Let's get him in position. Yeah. I may be past my prime, but I suggest you not patronize me. Oh, sorry, sir. You're not getting through to the end. Not if I can help it. Mate, we're going to go to the gym. The gym leaders. And it's going to be absolutely ooh, amazing. It's going to be wonderful. Let's do it. Alex and Noel. Latios! Uh-oh, that is a Latios. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That is a Latios. Don't worry about Eevee. Worry about Latios. Secret power on the Latios. Uh, are we brave enough to go Twin Needle on the Latios? Are we stupid enough to go Twin Needle on the Latios? Yes. Oh, damn it. I should have used Focus Energy. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Eevee went for Growl. Oh, that's annoying. It's alright. Wait, 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 wait. Slow it down, slow it down. We're going Secret Power. Latios. We're going Twin Needle. Latios. Oh, I lost a Purge. Uh oh, that's the end of Tongs. No, it's not. It's on ATL2. Well, that's the end of ATL2. We're okay. Special Defense dropped. Twin Needle. Get the poison, at least. Oh, okay. We don't want to take no Luster Purge, really. Come on. Oh, baby! Critical hit! ATL2 takes down Latios. We are safe, lads. How the hell are we safe? That's amazing. Partridge level 29. Eevee is going to growl for us. That's beautiful. And now, and now, our attack has dropped, but secret power. Actually, you use Recover. And you use Poison Fang. Let's go. Eevee use Quick Attack. That's fine. Glad I recovered this turn. There's the Poison Fang. Didn't do a lot, actually. There's Recover. You can go for Secret Power. You can go for Poison Fang. There you go. Secret Power, baby. It's going to be hurt by the Poison. Is that going to be enough to take it down? Oh, not quite enough, but that's okay. Eevee uses Quick Attack. Oh, okay. More like Crit Attack. Jesus Christ. All right, there you go. There you go. ATL2 is level 33. No one panic, lads. We are severely underleveled. How did we end up so severely underleveled? People died. People did die. Let's hyper potion up because I think I think that's the last battle before Legim Lee dares. Oh, oh, oh! Cheeky corridor. Right. So. Okay. We go this way, and we go... Wait, I'm a bit confused. So... Which way is this? Is this now the left way? Oh, oh, oh! There is a way think we go we go this way look uh, I get it I think I didn't do this bit before when you lose to me don't be too hard on yourself it's not that you're weak I'm just too strong even at the risk of life I will win this battle oh I did not know that there was another battle to be had right let's do it 
Veronica and Mark have an Anorith and a Linoon. Linoon, if it belly drums, is scary. Does belly drum exist at this point? I think it does. I want, I want to think it does. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and... We need to focus all power on the Linoon. More than anything. More than anything. We need to poison. We need to kill the Linoon. Does Linoon get guts? Linoon's attack missed, which is good. We go poison fang. Can we get the poison? We do. Good. That's good, 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 good. Secret power. It's a lovely hit. Not quite enough. Water gun from the Anorith. Okay. So Linoon is suffering. We're going to go Psybeam. And we're going to go Poison Fang. Yes. Cover. How dare you? How dare you? Down you go, you cheeky bugger. There you go. We we're all chilling. There's the Psybeam. Got a good chop on him. Bit of water gun. All right. He doesn't really have much of a move set on him. Bless him. Should we go Twin Needle? Nah, go Poison Fang. It's a good hit. It's not very effective. Got the poison, though. Got the Psybeam. Oh, Mud Sport. All right. He's hurt by the poison. We're going to go Psybeam. We're going to go Cut. There it is. There's the end of that battle. No worries there. We're absolutely fine. So, Mark and Veronica have been defeated. We don't have to worry about them anymore, but we do need to try and figure this out. So, we need to get them in a position where they'll both let us through. Oh, no, no, just where this guy let you through, see? No, because you see the issue? Oh, I see the issue. Stupid boy is stupid. So, you see? Oh, I get it. Oh, I get it. Okay. I think I get it. Um... Oh, I see. I see. I got it now. I got it now. He's only gone and figured it out. You see. Because you can't get back that way. But what you can do is you can go back this way. And then move these peeps. There it is. Look at that. And then you go here. And then we've already cleared this area. So you go here. And there it is. There's the gym leaders. Let's do this. Hey, were you surprised? Oh, were you surprised that there are two gym leaders? That there are two gym leaders? We're twins. We're twins. We don't need to talk because we can each determine what the other is thinking. All in our minds, the combination of us. Can you beat it? Oh, boy. Tate and Liza, let's go. Oh, baby. Let's go. May and Emma with Lombre and Gyarados. Holy. Oh, they're level 41. Oh, God. Yep, there's the Intimidate. Okay. Well. Uh, you... You know what? You know what? Secret power on the Lombre. Target the Lombre for the moment. Not focus energy. I didn't mean to focus energy. Oh, it, I wasn't going to get to move anyway. He's going for Hydro Pump. Okay. Okay. He's going for Hydro Pump. So we are going to heal up Tongs. And we are going to go for Twin Needle on the Lombre. There's the Hydro Pump on Tongs. This is not good. Just a crit. Just a crit. As always, just a crit. Never, you know, it, that, that, that's fine. That's fine. Let's just compare Tongs' special defense to everybody else, okay? Special defense 67. 72, so not that far. 72, not that far. They're both weak to water, by the way, so they'd have had as much chance of Tongs as surviving. Uh, more HP, I think. Yeah, more HP, but still. 71, not that far, but you do resist it, but you're a much lower level. 73, but you do resist it, and you are a higher level. You're going to be helpful. But basically... I'm annoyed. That crit mattered. That crit absolutely mattered. And that's frustrating. Uh, right. I guess we'll go... No, we can't send out Aqua Ace against the fucking... 
We can't send him out against a, a grass type. He'll die. I guess we're sending out Partridge. Partridge is underleveled, but it's better than sending out Aqua Ace, I reckon. Fury swipes. Okay. Okay. Let's go for a... Uh, let's go for a secret power. Wait. Wait. Pokemon. ATL2 summary, right? His attack is better than his special attack, so we're better off going secret power because it turns into a normal type move. And you can go Volt Tackle on the Gyarados. Do it. There's the Hydro Pump. We took it very well. That's a nice Volt Tackle right there. It did all right. Recoil damage. Secret power. Oh, a crit of her own. Not enough to take out the Lombre, though. Okay, we're good. We're good. So what we're going to do is going to go Hyper Potion. It's going to be on Partridge. We're going to fight. We're going to go Vault Tackle on the Gyarados again. Use the Hyper Potion on Lombre. That's not good. Withdrew Gyarados into Lantern. Wow. Okay. And it's got Vault Absorb. Oh my. This changes everything. Kind of. Can we, can we sing on you? There's a the spark. That's not good. Got the sing. Good. Okay, secret power. Lombre going fury swipes. Okay, so. Heal up Partridge. Partridge, you want to sing on the Lombre? Lantern's fast asleep. Got the sing. Hey, double sings. Nice. Right. Now we double in. You know what? Sharpen. And you go... Volt tackle on the Lombre. It'll be neutral. In that case, you might as well go extra sensory. Yeah, go extra sensory because it's a special move and you're a special attacker, actually. Yeah, Volt Tackle's a special attack, though, as well. That did nothing. That did nothing, okay. Sharpen. And you go... Don't go Volt Tackle, just keep going extra sensory. Okay, extra sensory. Sharpen. Lombre's fast asleep. Sharpen again. Extra sensory. We're going to keep this up. Lantern woke up and used water gun. That's okay. We resist that. No biggie there. Okay, there's the extra sensory. Good. There's the sharpen. Lombre woke up and used thief. Uh oh. Okay, that's fine. Uh, so we're going to sharpen again. And we're going to sing again on... I think the Lantern's the bigger threat. Confuse Ray's not good. Oh, no. Okay, we got the sing. Good. ATL2 is going to sharpen. That's all right. Okay, we're at, like, plus four attack. Water Sport is fine. That weakens fire's power. We're going to sharpen once more. We're going to sing again. Hopefully. Ah, oh, Partridge. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Lombre use Fury Swipes. We can take that. We can take that. Okay. Now it's your time to shine. Secret power on the lantern. Actually, on the lombre. And then you're going to use a potion on yourself. No, on ATL2. Yeah, to keep him alive. There we go. Good, 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 good. Lantern is fast asleep. We've got secret power on the lombre. It's got to be a knockout. We're at like plus four attack. Good job, ATL2. Good job, Partridge. Oh, there's the Gyarados. Or is that the same Gyarados? Or is that a new Gyarados? Okay, our attack went down. That's fine. We're going to go for Secret Power on the Gyarados. And Partridge, we're going to put up to full health. Yes. Gyarados on Hydro Pump. We resist that. That's okay. Lantern's fast asleep. That's good. Secret Power with, like, plus three attack. It's not enough to take out the Gyarados. That's sad. But we'll try it. We'll go again. And Partridge, you will sing. No, no, you won't. You will... You know what? Extra sensory. Another hyper potion on Gyarados. Okay. There's the spark. That's not good. Partridge snapped out of confusion. That's very good. Extra sensory. Get a bit of damage on the Gyarados. Critical hit. Secret power on the Gyarados. That's a good one. Oh, critical hit! 
Thank you, ATL2, taking out that Gyarados. Oh, my days. Partridge is level 30. Bless him. Getting a masterclass. Dragonair. Okay, Dragonair is a problem. Okay, we need to switch out Partridge this time. I'm going to sharpen. Dragonair is probably going to go for... I don't want to risk it. But I think Dragonair is probably going to go for Thunder Wave. If I know Dragonair's... I'm going to bring... No, you can't bring out Aqua Ace because of Spark. Can't bring out Modo because of Spark and Water-type moves. Go for Banassi. Predict the Spark. Predict the Spark or the Thunder Wave. Dragonair went Slam. Okay, that's very Dragonair. Oh, strong though. Poison Point, baby. That's good news. There's the Spark. There we go. Predicted the Spark. We've sharpened. That's good news. Attack Rose. Thank you very much. Dragonair's hurt by Poison. We are going to go for, I, I think, one more Sharpen. And Benassi, I very much suggest you go for a Body Slam on the Lantern. Try and paralyze it. Slam missed from the Dragonair. Lantern went Confuse Ray on Benassi. That's sad. Benassi got the Body Slam. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Shed Skin. Oh, Dragonair. Dragonair, you arsehole. Uh, we're going to go for one more Sharpen. And we're going to go for Body Slam. Go for it on the Dragonair. Went for the Slam. Missed. Nice. Lantern's going to Spark. Benassi is confused. Went for the Body Slam. Good, 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 good. Didn't get the Paralysis. That's okay. There's the Sharpen. We're going to go Secret Power on the Lantern. The Lantern is the big threat so far. Body Slam the Dragonair. Dragon Rage. That's 40 guaranteed hit points of damage. But at least it's guaranteed. There's Water Gun from the Lantern. That would be super effective. Oh my god, okay. Vanassi is confused. Went for body slam. Good. Paralyzed, paralyzed, paralyzed. Didn't paralyze. Secret power on the lantern for a decent hit. It's a good chunk of health. It's good enough to take it down. Beautiful. Don't worry about no water gun no more. Dragonair has a berry. Citrus berry, okay. Dragonair is the only thing left. So we play it safe. We play it safe with a turn of healing. Okay. That's how we play it safe. Hyper Potion on... Oh. Hyper Potion on Banassi. There we go. Dragonair, you slam. Yeah. We're fine. We're fine. We're going Secret Power. And... Poison Fang. Slam missed. We got this. We got this. No more worrying. We lost Tongs. God damn it. But there wasn't much we could do in that situation. It wasn't super effective. I'd have never thought of switching to my under-leveled Altaria in a million years. So Tong's death was not in vain, in my opinion. But there we go. We battered him. Eventually. Got past that scary Gyarados. Good lord. But the Mind Badge from Tate and Liza. Thank you very, very much. Good lord. But we did lose Tongs. That is sad. Mind Badge enhances the special attack and special defense of Pokemon. Oh, yeah. Remember when your stats used to be locked behind things? Also, let's use the HM move. Dive outside a battle. You should take this too. There we go. That's the voice I was using. TM04. But what could it be? 04. Muddy water. Oh, okay. Cheers. Right. Register with the Pokenav. We got the TM for Muddy Water. Where, where is it? There it is. Who can learn Muddy Water? Nobody! Nice. Right, let's leave. Let's head to the Pokemon Center. Oh, you're in Moss Deep, aren't we? I completely forgot where we were, to be honest. I didn't remember what gym we were in. So, let's go to the Pokemon Center. Move items from my party Pokemon. Uh, Tongs. I will take... I will take this. You've been a very good Beedrill. Uh, should we bag it? Yeah. Actually, let's... Uh, let's real quickly... Yeah, continue box operations. Let's take the Soul Dew off you. Actually, no. You can keep that. What have you got? Red Flute. You've got a Red Flute. You've got a Spell Tag. White Flute. Oh, it's no biggie. What are you holding? Lax Incense. Oh, yeah. Take that from you. Put that in the bag. Uh, okay, so deposit Pokemon. We're going to deposit Tongs. You've been 
One heck of a Pokemon, Tongs, you have. You have been absolutely wonderful. I've... You... I, I never thought I could have such a pleasing experience by uh, raising a Beedrill. But Tongs was one of those Beedrills that just really... Like, think out lot. When did we catch Tongs? What route did we catch Tongs on? Route... F level 5. We met him at Level 5, Petalburg Woods. That's so early in the game. We've had him for so long. What a great Pokemon Tongs turned out to be. Right, we got a slot in the party. Uh, was a bug type. We've got loads of water. We don't, well, we got a water type. We don't need another. Explode's not a bad shout, but it is a normal type. Uh, we could go for Dusclops. Needs a lot of raising. We've already got a fire type. We could put Jolteon in the party. That's, that's always an option, I suppose. Or we could raise a grass type. Uh, how much we got fire weakness? We don't have a lot of fire weakness. So a jump luff. We could use a jump luff. I'm tempted. We could put Q-tip in the party. But then we could use election. Why did I call you election? I don't remember why I called you election. Uh, or we could go with Scoob. Or we could go with Martin the Soul Rock. I mean, I, I, whatever we choose is going to need a heck of a lot of leveling. Uh, oh, we got we got space. Why don't we space? I forgot why I gave half these names to these Pokemon. We could bring out Wingle. Uh, risky. Let's go Jumpluff. Let's put Jumpluff in the party. Why not? We'll get you leveled up, Q-Tip, and it will all be lovely. But that is where I'll leave this episode for today. We're going to head to somewhere. I need to figure out where I'm going next. So thank you for watching. Wear a mask. It's not hard, is it? I've proven it. Just wear a bloody mask. It's really not that difficult. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Hit like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. All that jazzy stuff. Use code ACE for money off G Fuel. And until the 24th of July, code ACE will get you 15% rather than 10 off Control Freak products. So, you know, get some precision. Get some of these, these awesome thumbstick things as well. That's always a good idea. Because that's helped me get better at Call of Duty and all that. So anyway, thanks for watching. I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Keep on training.